the utility bill, the electric bill, and I had to pay rent today. Good morning, Jules. Today is July, July 1st. 1st. Guys, it's been officially one month since I moved here, and I just got the utility bill, the electric bill, and I had to pay rent today, so... Open your purse. Open your purse. This is a big deal because even in past, like in Korea, I pay the money up front for my place. But here, I have to pay monthly and all my hard-earned money that I made last month is going straight to my property managers. Oh, I'm not used to giving away this much money every month. Um, this is a house. So it's not gonna be a couple hundreds of dollars. I'm gonna go mail in my bills. And yeah, my first... This is, a, this is really cool that I get to document this, but this is my first time paying rent. So yeah. Also, I'm gonna go shopping because it is the first of the month and I have to feed my family. So yeah. Uh, I'm not gonna forget my grocery list. These are all the bills we're paying this month, and then I'm gonna return something from Amazon. I'm in the Asian store right now, guys, and they have so much mochi. Mochi. Oh my gosh, guys, they have that brown sugar full of ice cream. <gasps> There's like four left. There's like limit two per person. guys this is my current status of my fridge and freezer there's nothing in it so let's go ahead and start filling it up we are done filling up the fridge took forever but this is all we have for now um yeah hello my jewels i just filmed a mukbang and usually after a mukbang i really really need to sit down and like catch my breath <laughs> it was a sweet mukbang and i usually have a lot of trouble with that i remember back then i was talking to another mukbanger and i was like oh my god sweet mukbangs are so painful but they're really nice treat once in a while yeah i'm so excited guys today because my dining table just came as you guys know i just moved and it's my first ever dining room to decorate Guys, we've been struggling to move in still. Look at all this junk that's at the front door. We finished unpacking the kitchen the other day, but here is my dining table. Um, okay, guys, after I create this table, hopefully I'm not tired enough because I'm set to make dinner tonight for my mom and I. Oh my gosh, yesterday, guys, we walked the floor, so I feel much more comfortable. Anyway, one. 
it's done. Oh my god, so cute. So it seats four people. Oh my gosh, I feel like I'm in a cafe in Korea. <laughs> oh my god, it's so cute. I love it. It feels very stable so far. We'll test it out for a couple of days, and if something is wrong, knock on wood, um, I'll have to take it apart and set it back. But for now, I'm really digging it. I love it. I built this, guys, in less than an hour. So proud of myself. Okay. Close your eyes. Okay, close your eyes. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's okay. an amazing chair. Isn't it cute? It fit perfectly. Yeah. Oh my god, it's red and white. All oh, white. So perfect. Okay, in the you legs. Can try Ooh. Yay! We got a chair. Ooh. Oh my god. So the other day my dishes came too, so I really want to show you. They're really cute and low key and so my aesthetic. I wouldn't go get them. I need a plates that are microwave, dishwasher safe, and it will last like a really long time. Plus, guys, I don't know if you guys can tell, it's not completely white plates. These are really cute pink ones, like a very muted pink. I honestly wanted it a little bit more pink, but this is fine too. So let me set the table really quick. So cute. Oh my goodness. This is, oh my gosh, I finally feel like I have a dining room. So I'll link this beautiful table that I found on Amazon down below, as well as these dishes, which I also got on Amazon. They shipped pretty fast. I'm really happy because it's my first week living here and we are already having dinner soon. First thing I'm going to do is boil my spaghetti. Thank you to the people who voted on Instagram. Uh, I decided to go for spaghetti. So mom has been hoarding onto these pots for years and we're finally able to use them. They're really cute. I'm going to be making spinach pasta along with regular like tomato pasta. So, one of my newest obsessions is spinach pasta. It's so pretty, guys. And I'm not only preparing this for tonight's dinner, but for mukbang, olive oil. Start off with this much. Okay, that's first round of spinach pot pick. Pies. I saw these at the grocery store and I had to get them. They're only $3.98. So let's or this is gonna be a side dish. I wish I could make these for my nephew right now. He freaking loves dinosaurs. He's like Deja Migu Pante. I like to call him my Walmart, Walmart version of Deja Migu Pante. Ah, it's so cute. Oh my god, the flying one too. Oh my gosh, there's actually a lot of variety. Like some are chubbier than the others. Okay, this said one single layer. Okay, this is good for me and my mom. Take some garlic, like a lot. We love garlic in this house. This is super red. Take tomato base one. And then boom. The spinach one. Pasta. Oh my goodness. Okay, my mom is still not here, guys, so I'm so confused. Okay, guys. I think I'm just gonna wait for my mom. And in the meantime, take Instagram pictures and whatnot. My mom came home two hours late. She left me. Home. It was so dry now. <laughs> but it looks very good on camera still. Bon appetit. Do you want to pray? Oh, Amen. Amen. Amen.